Hey guys, uh, welcome to your general reading uh, for um, Scorpio. What uh, karma are they currently facing for October 2022? You could apply this to any of your placements. So we're going to take a look at the person that you're currently dealing with or the person that you've dealt with, how this person did you dirty. And then we'll finish off the read to see what karma this person is currently facing or will face moving forward. Apply this to your own unique situation. Switch the rules if you want. Could be a situation that uh, it's karma that you're cycling through. Um, uh, take what resonates, leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. If you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up, like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Um, I, I think I already said this. Oh, um, uh, also, um, this reading is um, for the collective consciousness, co collective consciousness of Scorpio, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. So if you're looking for a reading tailored to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. So uh, Scorpio, let's get started. Tell me about Scorpio here. The person that Scorpio is dealing with or was dealing with, how did this person do Scorpio dirty? How did this person do Scorpio dirty for October 2022? How did this person do Scorpio dirty for October 2022? The star, Aquarius energy. Okay, could be dealing with other Aquarius. You might have Aquarius in your chart. We have the King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Oh, that's you right there. Could be dealing with another Scorpio here. Ace of Swords and Justice. I don't know. It seems like maybe this person was not really being honest with you or honest with themselves about how they felt about you. Okay. I feel like there's like a cagey energy. I feel like it, there's a bit of a dodgy energy with this person. All right, let's see what else we have here. We have Temperance here and the Knight of Pentacles. So Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sagittarius energy with that Temperance card. I don't know. I feel like this person was keeping secrets from you or that, you know, I feel like the universe was showing your person that, okay, you know, Scorpio is, uh, you know, they're, they're basically, you are their person, but I feel like this person was not really honoring what they were feeling towards you and I feel like what happened was I feel like this person wanted to take things slow wanted to let things naturally unfold and develop but I feel like this person didn't really tell you that I don't know if this person felt like you know they, that you could read their mind but that was not the case here I feel like there was a bit of a misunderstanding here the star why is the star here with the King of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the King of Cups, and the Seven of Cups. Yeah, I feel like this person was giving you a lot of mixed signals here, okay? They were telling you one thing, they were doing something completely different here, and I feel like maybe this person just completely confused the crap out of you here, uh, 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 Scorpio. Ace of Swords, we have the Six of Wands, Justice, and the Lovers. You guys both have a very strong soul connection. Perhaps even the soul contract here with the justice card. You know, with the six of wands and the ace of swords, the lovers here. And I do feel like this person saw victory here with you. Success. The thing is, you know, I feel like this person expected you to read their mind or something like that. Like I said, I feel like this person was giving you some big bit of a mixed signal here. Tell me about temperance. Why is temperance here? Five of pentacles, knight of pentacles, and the ace of cups. You know, I feel like this person also left you out in the cold here too. I feel like this person was being guided to do the right thing here, but I feel like this person did something completely opposite because I feel like this person could have been in some sort of fight or flight response here. Okay. You know, I do feel like this person is, when they communicate, I feel like this person is very unclear. Yeah, very unclear. 
it's kind of like putting a puzzle together. They drop little hints, drop a little, uh, uh, like little nuggets for you to figure out. All right. Uh, what karma is this person currently facing or will face moving forward for October 2022? One more. All right, Three of Pentacles and the Emperor, Aries energy, the Death card, Scorpio energy, and the Three of Wands, and the Empress here in the Strength card. Wow. There is a soulmate connection here. We have the Empress, the Emperor, two divine, uh, two divine souls here. Um, divine counterpart, Death card, and the Three of Wands. I feel like this is you, um, Scorpio, this, this Empress, this feminine energy. It's like, you know, an energy of you knowing your self-worth and you feel like the karma that this person is going to experience is that you're not opening the door for them again. Yeah. Because it's too overwhelming for you. I just feel like you don't want to go through another tarot moment here with this person, Scorpio. But it seems like we have someone here that wants to come in and work things out here with you. But I feel like you might not want that anymore, Scorpio. It's just too hard communicating with this person for you. Tell me about the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Why is the Three of Pentacles here? All right, the Wheel of Fortune, the Emperor here, and the Eight of Swords. So the shoe is definitely on the other foot here, in a way. I feel, I feel like there's a fear that this person's feeling, your person's feeling, that this won't come back together again. Death. Why is death here? We have the Nine of Cups, the Three of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles. So I feel like this person wishes that you won't turn them away. Wishes that you won't move on from them or let them go. Or give them another chance here. It seems like they're finally realizing that you are their wish fulfillment but it seems like it could be a situation that it's too late empress ten of swords two of pentacles yeah i feel like you've been betrayed because i feel like this person was going back and forth uh, i don't really see this person juggling you with somebody else this also could be a same sex relationship someone here could be bisexual here too maybe this person was exploring uh, another person of the same sex here. Maybe, yeah, there is some sort of balancing or, or juggling here. And I feel like you betrayed, you felt betrayed by this person because they were not honest here. Okay. So, um, so Scorpio, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.